Gabe Kalsher and Jaron Holmes have graduated. Nine new players have arrived this year to join the team with leaders such as Taman Lipsy, Trey King, and Robert Jones. KCCI Shannon Earhart went to media day to hear what it will take for this unit to succeed. Defense. It runs through the veins of the Iowa State Cyclones. We're going to continue to uphold that standard that that's what, you know, that's our expectation and that's where we're going to demand it will be. The Cyclones had the best scoring defense in the Big 12 last season, but ranked near the bottom in almost every offensive category. On paper in 2023, that's quite the opposite. We certainly have more options, right? More guys that could play the point guard position, more that can handle the basketball, um, probably more guys that have shown to make a shot from time to time. Coach TJ Atzelberger said that his team's offensive greatness isn't going to come from flying up and down the corridor, taking the three ball, but from right here, 15 feet away. The Cyclones shot a flinching 67% from the stripe last season. But this year, we have that relationship to where it's like, hey, like your free throws is you know, not looking too good. Like you need to work on it. And everyone knows that. After practice every day, we all shoot 50 free throws, 50 plus free throws. You got to shoot 50 in a row. A beneficial pastime. The next day, you just try to beat it. And the next day after that, you just try to beat it. And then you'll get more consistent with it and you'll get better. So over time, it's been getting better for a lot of us. And it's been really helpful for our team. Yeah, I mean, it's good. Like, we have a whole dry erase board, and you can see everyone's numbers, and it's kind of like bragging rights. It's like friendly competition. Shannon Earhart, KCCI Iowa Sports Leader.